Now it says we can catch a Wagasaki or whatever, however you say that. I butcher other languages, so not very good at it. There's some Wagasakis right there. See if we can catch one of those things. Yep, there's a Wagasaki right there. Trying to get myself situated. Says they like flies. And there's one. Wagasagis are uh, kind of small, so we got a number 12 hook and a fly, and it says they like flies. But this is what we need to catch, these little guys. And that one right there. Just to get on our hook. Yeah, you. <laughs> That's the last fish we need. That's what we're trying to catch here. They've been a little elusive too. But it's based on your the hook size and the bait and all of that. So you would think we'd catch one of them over here. As we're seeing them and the hooks too small for all the other fish I would doubt it's too small for a Wagasaki one of those little guys that's what we're trying to catch right now But I did try to catch them once before and I had a really tough time doing it. This is my second attempt trying to catch them. I wasn't too successful the last time. I didn't spend an awful long time, but I might have to do a little more research. on catching them. I mean they're in the area. We'll have to check our bait. Let's see if we find another bait that they seem to like. All they're doing is swimming around. They're not interested. Okay. There are Wagasakis in here. Wagasakis like bread. Let's try that. See if we can find them again. The 
there's one right there. Got a tiny piece of bread on there. Maybe these Wagasakis like bread better. We'll see. We have a number 12 hook and a piece of bread. I don't think anything else can really hit that. Yeah, one of you. <laughs> that one. We need one of those. Closest I've seen one come to my hook, so maybe we'll get lucky. Down there is one. We need to come back over here and hit this bait. Been a little elusive. trying not having a whole lot of luck catching them I wouldn't think they need a larger hook have to know we're here. Well, they're swimming around our bait. Having a tough time getting them interested. Maybe we need to try a little bit larger hook. I don't know. There's a couple of them over here. We tried a hair bit larger hook. Just trying to see what they want. At the moment, I really don't know what they want. There's one. He wanted a little bit larger hook. They don't like a number 12. He is a small one. It's a new record, 0 .02. <laughs> number 8 hook with a piece of bread. And we actually caught one. <laughs> yeah, take a picture. <laughs> Yeah, we're taking a video. We actually caught one on a number eight and a piece of bread. They probably hit a fly too. But at least we caught one. Oh, we got another one. Wow. Hitting the jackpot. We're going to have to uh, check our recording too after this to make sure we're actually recording. Since we're actually working. 
Wagasaki, another new record, 0 0.02. Little bitty guy. On number eight, and a piece of bread. Okay, let's check our recording. Well, at least we have caught a couple. See if we can find some more Wakasaki, Wakasakis. There's one right there. Three right there. Let's kind of stick it in the center of all of them. There's like four in this area. And then we back up where we're not on top of the bait. Might have found what they're looking for. Number eight hook, I think, is the key. Not a number 12, because I have tried twice with a number 12 and I can't get them to hit. But with a number 8 hook and uh, now a bread, I, well, you can probably use a fly also to catch them. But we've had much more luck with a number 8 hook. I think that's the key. There's another one. A Wakasaki, a .05, and he's definitely a new record. It's amazing that, but you would use these for bait, actually. That's what you'd use them for. Yeah, now we're cooking. Finally figured out what they wanted and how to catch them. That's the whole idea. So I go through the, spain, the painstaking details of trying to figure out what in the world do these guys want. And then I bring it to you. <laughs> and that's what the fish series is all about. This is our last fish. And all of the fish series, unless they bring out another DLC. Our next part will be the lures. We'll probably take every lure and based on the type of uh, fish they catch and go around and catch them. Another point oh two, number eight hook, piece of bread. Skies are pretty cloudy. There's another one over there. We're almost on the ground on this one. kind of feel around to see how how oriented I am because I'm in a VR headset an HP Reverb G2 it's a good headset and I like it here we got one coming yeah we figured it out it's that number eight hook this is what we needed Point oh four, number eight, with bread. We figured them out. Trying to get situated here. Do 
do everything by feel. <laughs> no, there's another one. Okay, well, I think this will probably be it. I think we figured them out. Well, I appreciate you coming along. Number eight and a piece of bread. Be sure you come along again. That does it for Japan and the Wakasaki. That was our last fish that we needed to figure out, and we did. And we're going to do the lures next. And we're going to take each lure, and uh, you might have to move around the different lakes, but we'll see. If we can catch them, then that's all that we're really looking for. So we'll see if we can take each lure and try to figure out how to catch fish with them. So until the next series, thank you for watching. Goodbye.